Welcome to Celebrating Life in Science. I'm Joan Gerber Walker, President and CEO of AZ Bio, the Arizona Bio Industry Association. The people working within Arizona's bioscience sector share a common bond and a commitment to making life better for people in Arizona, across the United States, and around the world. It's my great privilege to work with and learn from Arizona educators, researchers, entrepreneurs, and healthcare professionals who live at the crossroads of life and science. Tonight, we invite you to get to know some of our Arizona innovators as we share their stories. What they do impact our lives today and shapes our opportunities for better health in the future. To get us started, we have invited a very special guest. He is a longtime champion for Arizona's life science sector and has been repeatedly reminding us that now, more than ever, it is important to make good decisions and follow the science. Hello, this is Governor Doug Ducey joining you to celebrate Arizona's bioscience sector. It's my pleasure to introduce you to some of the sector's leaders. For over 20 years, the people of Arizona have strategically invested in the biosciences. We've built and expanded our world-class research institutes, including TGen, the ASU Biodesign Institute, the Bio5 Institute, and the Arizona Cancer Center at the University of Arizona along with the Barrow Neurological Institute, the Arizona Alzheimer's Consortium, and more. Arizona's hospital systems have also grown dramatically over the last two decades, more than doubling the number of skilled healthcare professionals who work day and night to support patients and their families from around the world. And Arizona's medical schools at the University of Arizona, Mayo Clinic, Midwestern University, A.T. Still, and Creighton University are training the next generation of physicians and medical professionals to help meet the needs of our growing communities. Over 300,000 Arizonans work in healthcare and the biosciences and their impact is worldwide. Medical device companies like BD, Dexcom, Medtronic, MERS, and WL Gore delivering life-saving products Innovators like Roche Tissue Diagnostics, equipping oncologists to diagnose and treat disease. Celgene, part of Bristol-Myers Squibb, making an important drug to treat cancers and so much more. In 2020, as we rise to meet the challenge of COVID-19, our investments in bioscience and healthcare infrastructure are more important than ever. The teams at SonoraQuest, ASU Biodesign, the University of Arizona, and others have been essential partners in getting Arizonans the test they need. Arizona's healthcare workers have served with compassion and care in the face of adversity. And our citizens continue to do their part every day to slow the spread of this virus. Since the pandemic began, Arizona has been guided by data and science and tonight, you'll have the opportunity to get to know some of the faces behind the science as they work to discover, develop, and deliver healthcare products and services. To everyone watching, thank you for joining us. And thank you for everything you are doing to help Arizona through this crisis. Let's remember, we'll get through this together, and we're stronger together. Thank you.